Our top story, more calls for change on school safety in Texas. Today, Uvalde families joined State Senator Roland Gutierrez as he announced new legislation in Austin. One of the bills he is leading would improve emergency response between local and state officials in the wake of the deadly mass shooting at Robb Elementary. Ken's 5 Sarah Duran joins us live from the state capitol ex to explain how this bill would help. Sarah. Deborah, there is more to this bill, but to simply put it, this bill would prevent future breakdowns in communications between first responders at all levels. Now, you and I both know, Deborah, that communication was a major problem during the mass shooting at Robb Elementary. Officials blamed inoperable radios as part of their delayed response. This bill will establish emergency radio infrastructure in rural areas, allowing all public safety officials to communicate. It would also create a mass shooting training program to increase response times. And in 77 minutes, children died. The average mass shooting is 12 to 14 minutes. You know that. This one took 77 minutes. We know that four bodies came out of that building. A teacher and three little kids with a pulse. Had they got there in the 12 or the 14 minutes, they might have lived. Let them know what you're feeling. Now, Gutierrez filed another bill that would add a state trooper to each public school campus in the state. Lastly, he proposed a resolution that would put a monument here on the Capitol grounds to honor the victims and survivors of mass gun violence. Now, these aren't the only bills Gutierrez is working on. He plans to file up to 20 Uvalde-related bills during this legislative session. At the state capitol, Sarah Duran, Ken's 5. And today, Senator Gutierrez also made two appropriations Thank requests you. worth $4 billion. The first would allocate money to mental health care access. The second would go to school hardening measures such as fencing and bulletproof glass windows.